Thanks for tuning in to the No Clearance Podcast. Now subscribe, hit that like button, and enjoy the clip. I cannot. I just uh, found it. Jet was chewing on it. I took it from him. Jesus Christ. And he choked. Jesus. <laughs> What's that? Uh, what else speaking we got? of music, yeah. My girl, Glorilla, yeah, she dropped an EP. Don't play with her. We're yeah. out fucking side. I think City Girls is up by 3,000. What you think? What you think of it? Uh, Project. I per- it's what I would expect from Glorilla. And I don't mean that in a negative way. It's raunchy. It's gutter. It is some shit I know niggas can bump and not be like, period. You know what I mean? It's that. I feel like she's well, also on Jalen. Yeah. I think she's our first unisex female rapper. She is. I think so. I think so. I agree I, with You that. see a lot of men like. And, like, when I mean, like, you see a lot of men, like, you, when uh, F and F come on, it's not just bitches getting amps. I mean, niggas is throwing bowls. I like, had, hold on. I had, I had, a, I had like, four dudes come up to me a couple weeks ago and was like, yo, Glorilla's nice. <laughs> like, hey. four different dudes. Like, I, feel like, F and F, and I was like, Every yo, nigga she's can, actually nice. Everybody can relate to being fuck nigga free. Yeah. Like, even men got fuck niggas in their life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that. He, gay and straight. He still got <laughs> fuck niggas in our life. I, he said gay niggas. straight. Doesn't matter, babe. Yeah. yeah. You know, I thought it was okay. I she I see the potential. I okay. I see the potential. I, yeah. I feel like a couple things for me. She had mm-hmm. the same flow in every song. Mm. And it just seemed very it just seemed a bit repetitive. Uh, I did like Fat and All. I thought that was funny. Yeah, I thought fat. that was cool. Yeah, I like that. Uh, but I just felt like there was, I didn't feel like anything outside of the hits was like catching me. But I feel like she got potential. I think I'm, I'm, I'm interested to see where her career goes, especially under Yo Gotti. I'm excited to see where it goes. I feel like this was an EP. Like nine it felt songs. Like it- it felt oh, like it's 12. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's nine, yeah, because the music. I, okay. I felt like this was an EP. I felt like um, it was good. It was just like it felt like an EP. It felt, it, I, like you said, Ty, I could see the potential. Like, I thought, like, the hits, the hits are hitting. And then I like yeah. that and all. But, like, it was just like, it's like one step below an album, in my opinion. Mm. Oh, Blessed was uh, blessed was good, too. I yeah, like I heard that song before. That was a good one. I like that song. I So, I think. Thinking about the song, I'm trying to think of the songs that wasn't like Bless was definitely out before for a little yeah. bit. Tomorrow too, that's the an anthem that was out. Thinking about the songs that she didn't put out, I love, and this might you know, might sus- not surprise many, but my favorite song on here is Nut Quick. I, I knew you were gonna say Nut Quick. I knew you were gonna say Nut Quick. I, I, say I, nut quick. I, I actually had no. That was Tyler, we should have made a bet. We should have made a bet. I feel like that quick she, was solid. But yeah. I will, but I will say, the flow comment, Tyler. I get that, but I think uh, she needs to figure out. And I think it's hard because with her voice, I think she's. I followed her. I like when I'm into an artist, I do my research and I dig in. So she's having. She had. I wouldn't say trouble, but you can tell she had to figure out how to use her voice. Mm, like yeah, in yeah. her earlier stuff, her voice wasn't, she, you could tell she was like trying very hard to like be like not so deep and like, you know, gritty. Now she's like, all right, now I like my voice. I like how deep and gritty it sounds. So I think now that she's figured out her voice, then I think the next project, all right, now let's hone in on our flow. Like let's try yeah. to switch it up and, and differentiate it. But oh, I, I fuck with it. It I, sounds I, like, I, and it, also, honestly, it sounds like it's her first time yeah. making a bunch of songs and putting them on a project. That's it fair. Sound, it, mm-hmm. it, not like a mixtape, but like first time like professionally doing, having like professionals do mm-hmm. it for her. I so also like, feel like um, if okay, her her actual album, I mm-hmm. feel like she definitely gonna have black youngster. She gonna get some like, yeah. bad yo features. Like the CMG sure. CMG group gonna definitely look out for like. Um, like I, I think it's just going to get bigger for her, for real, for real. Yeah, like, Yo Gotti. Everybody, most of the people on the Yo Gotti's label has been. I think she, successful. I think she's going to be the biggest one. Bigger than Money Bag? I think. I think, I think so. I think so. Just from you like gotta the, think she's tapping in. You gotta. I think she's going to be big, bigger because I think she's done a lot in in like 
t- her tunnel vision. Does that make yeah. sense? Like, I think she did a cleanse. And it's so funny. She did, a, I think, a 60-day cleanse. She's like, no fucking, no drinking, no nothing. She's like, she fucked up and was drinking, but that's fine. The other shit she didn't do. But she said she was really focused on the music and took all the distractions out. And then that's when FNF jumped off literally at the end of her cleanse. So mm. I think her mindset is like, hey, if I could, like, buckle down, focus, and this shit happen, like, if I really just, like, really buckle down, focus on the craft, like, I could be unstoppable. I And I think that's why this sounds like so much potential is because yes i think she was like finally in a real studio not nobody's you know project makeshift garage type shit not no shade to that because i think you know we we got bangers from her off of that kind of vibe but now it's like okay now we're taking it up a notch and i also think like she was wasn't signed she wasn't getting major pushing she didn't have niggas investing into her so now there's a lot of backing there's a lot of money going into her and so not to say that Moneybag Yo is not there, but I his, don't know. His album is still one of the top hip hop joints right now. Gangsta's Par- is it Gangsta's Paradise? That's what it was called. I I like, uh, yeah, it, but true. that that joint's still well, going crazy. What I'm right saying now. is, what I'm saying, what I'm saying, she's gonna be the biggest is because, like, like we were saying, men and women love her. Mm-hmm. So like that's why I know that because like there's some people who don't listen to Money Bag Yo and it, like there's still women who don't listen to most of the Money Bag Yo stuff. Like, like no shade, the hit. I I don't. I think I'm very selective on his music. Like it, I can't mm. listen to every track. Mm. Glorilla, the bitch could just be saying A B. I mean, the girl was singing Llama Llama Red Pajama, and I was into that. Yeah, like on the F and F B. Yeah, Llama Llama Red Pajama. I was like, come on. I wanted nah, to play she, it for my kids, but I was like, you shouldn't even know who Glow really is, to be real with you. I'm I'm excited for her. Um I mean, yeah, yeah. I really I'm looking forward to this, especially with the label she's under. She gonna do some things. Yeah. yeah. I think she yeah, she's gonna this is a good uh this is a good start. And I know, I mean, and then anytime to she gonna get some good collabs. Anytime two uh, women rappers like come together, it's always some of the one of some of the biggest songs for the summer. So I I, mm. I feel like a Glorilla Meg gonna come in the future. Mm-hmm. Hey, I would have just loved to hear Meg on Nut Quick because I would just love to hear Meg. We'll see. Stupid. That's that sounds like that might be one. a remix. I feel like that might be a remix. I hey, think, let's hey, just put it out there. Let's put it out, we, Khadija. We, put it out we there. Called it. We called it. Go ahead. Megan the Stallion is gonna be on Nut Quick on the remix, and it's gonna go stupid. Yeah. And I'm not gonna have no act right. I'm gonna be twerking on headlights. <laughs> not twerking on headlights. I'm, I, I'm telling you. I think my neighbors are real tired of me. They're like, one minute she's playing gospel, next minute she's playing Glorilla. <laughs> what gospel you? What gospel you listening to? Khadija? I so I put on gospel radio and i just let it let it okay rock. okay I I, i'm right. not good at figuring because if i was to pick the gospel songs i'm picking the shackles you know what i mean i'm of picking course. the go-to of you course. know i'm not picking i'm picking smile you know oh, yeah. I'm not, these are classics <laughs> but i'm not i'm not into like the new gospel of today does that make me sense? neither yeah. i still listen to <laughs> mississippi mass choir <laughs> I listened to the children's Mississippi <laughs> Mass Choir. <laughs> oh my, my wife hate when I be playing the old choir so Oh, he kept me. <laughs> hey, happy on sister act. Hey, they went crazy on that. Sounds oh, like that. Oh, happy right. day. That's funny as hell. You out um, here just. Yeah. Hey, life's about balance. You know, you gotta have. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? One day. That's I why I love putting my makes. like my libraries in shuffle because we might be praising the Lord on this track. I, the next track, we're shooting up the club. I hey, might, yeah, I always put. We're I've catching bodies. Put, you know what I've I mean? I've always been a uh, putting gotcha. music on shuffle type of person. Like if I okay, if I, like, are you I, a put music on shuffle but skip seven times, or are you just a shuffle and ride? It depends. I'm the, I'll click shuffle, but I'm like, nah, I'm not, I'll go until I want to hear the song I want to hear. No, 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 no. Yeah. Well, I don't start off a song. I don't start with a song I don't like. If you had shuffle in the song you don't want to listen to, you don't start with that. That's bad vibes. It, okay. I, thought I think that's me. low vibration. Somebody vibrations. on TikTok was like, I think that's, is, that, is like, that low you know vibration? Who does that though? You click shuffle and it's the wrong song. That's the wrong energy. You got to Yeah, you don't want to do vibes that. Yeah. 
Big you facts. don't want to be like, all right, I'm getting ready to go out to the club, and you put on put it on shuffle, and it's like, truth is, I'm t- talking about take me to the king. It's like, mm. yeah, <laughs> <laughs> not really trying to pregame to take me to the king, right? <laughs> you know, I mean, you know, or you can have your wine. I mean, you could pregame. <laughs> Oh, you got your wine. To the key. Yeah, yeah. What was shout that? The body of God, uh, of, of God, too? The, 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 yeah, yeah, the little. Shit. Wait, 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 uh, the last time bread. I went to church. You know what I mean? It's okay. Because uh, he, I, you know, God is with me everywhere I go. Um, <laughs> yes, he is. Praise him. Uh, <laughs> you want to do. Do you. <laughs> I sound like a fucking heathen. I swear to God, I, I love God in His glory. Whoa, somebody's gonna be like, let's pray for this. Oh, That's why I don't man. say nothing when y'all talk about God because you know I'm keep my mouth. Jay would be dumb quiet though. Jay would be like, yeah, quiet. Man, I, ain't ahead, again, I ain't getting in trouble. Not by him he, up there. He, he, I don't he, know. Hey, I don't know. what is? Yeah. Hey, what does everybody say, Tyler? He knows my heart. He know your heart. Yeah, <laughs> he, he knows my heart. But I keep my mouth shut. <laughs> he knows my heart. My, uh, my heart. Oh my god, I wanted to talk about this Because uh, I was excited that we all three saw Black Panther Wakanda Forever 